Now let's quickly talk through the wildcard mask because ACLs require a wildcard mask. Wildcard mask can block a range of addresses or a whole network with just one statement. Zeros indicate which part of an IP address must match the ACL. Ones indicate which part of an IP address doesn't have to specifically match the ACL. Use the host parameter in place of 0000 wildcard or use the any parameter in place of 255.255.255.255 wildcard. And here's a quick chart. So if you want to match the entire IP address exactly, then you're going to have to say 0.0.0.0. .0, .0, .0, .0. And if you want to match anything, then you'll say 255.255.255.255 at the very bottom. And that means all 32 bits can be matched because those are don't care bits. Now let me do quick whiteboarding to explain wildcard mask compared to the standard subnet mask that we are used to. So if you look at a subnet mask, let's say a slash eight subnet mask, what do we have? We have 255.0.0.0. We have slash 16, that's 255.255.0.0. And if we have slash 24, that is 255.255.255. .255 .255 now, what happens in a wildcard mask is, by the way, in one of the earlier videos, I covered the wildcard mask, but consider this a review. And review never hurts. So I decided to give it a shot so you guys can solidify this concept in your head. So to the left is the subnet mask. But here, let's do the wildcard mask or WM. So the opposite so remember wildcard mask is the mirror opposite of a subnet mask so mirror opposite would mean we'll go from slash 8 being 255.0.0.0 to 0.0.0.0 .0 .0 .0 to 255 so it's literally the opposite in this case for slash 16 it's 0.0.255.255 .0 .0 and in the case of slash 24, it's 0.0.0.255. And like I said, this is the mirror opposite of the subnet mask, the wildcard mask. Now, you may be thinking, how about some tricky scenarios? Let me give you a couple of tricky scenarios. How about slash 12? So let's first look at the subnet mask. So that's 255 dot, now 255 is eight bits, right? So an IP address is divided into 32 bits, which means it's eight bits plus eight bits plus eight bits plus eight bits. So each octet happens to be eight bits, right? So in slash 12, the first octet is 255. What about the second octet? Well, here, what ends up happening is, if you guys remember the handy dandy binary conversion chart, one, two, four, eight, 16, 32, 64, 128. Let's see what 12 gives us. So that's four bits. One, two, three, four. That gives us a 240. If you were to add 128 plus 64 plus 32 plus 16, that gives us a value of 240. So we'll place 240 here, and then we'll do 0, .0, .0, 0. Now that's a subnet mask. Now, how do we come up with a wildcard mask from this subnet mask? So what's going to end up happening is 255 is going to turn into 0. And here's the trick. What you will do to convert 240 into wildcard mask would be, we'll write down 255 minus 240. What does that give us? It gives us a value of 15. We'll place 15 right here. 
and then we'll go 255.255. So remember in wildcard mask, zero means I care and 255 means I don't care in terms of bits. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, give me a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.